Hey, we're here at the Husker Harvest Day show site with Mike Swingman, agronomy and R&D manager for Central Valley Ag. And Hagee has brought out their cover crop interseeder to seed a six-way cover crop mix at the corn demo fields here at the site. Uh, Mike, uh, can you tell us a little bit about some of the advantages of uh, early establishment through an interseeder like this? You know, this really gives us the, the advantage of getting that seed established early on. So we get the right amount of growth to, especially with our tillage radishes and our turnips, to help break up that compaction and even really help carry the load during harvest, you know, the, the combine load, grain car load, help, you know, give us some uh, cushion from all that future compaction and break up any compaction when issues we might have caused throughout this growing season. As well as it really helps us take in some of those nutrients now while the soil is warmer and those nutrients are available. You know, the radishes and turnips are going to pull in some potassium to release into next year's corn crop. And the rye is going to pull up some of those nitrates that are left in that top foot and sequester them so we don't have to worry about them from a leaching standpoint going on. So it's really important to us to get really good establishment of those crops to, to help us sequester some of those nutrients, break up that compaction, and, and really help us give us some cushion from our harvest standpoint if harvest would get a little wet so this is an advantage we can get into this crop a little earlier uh, we can get a better coverage of that seed and from an agronomic standpoint it's really a lot of advantage to us over other options of seeding cover crops now as far as germination goes i mean that's something that i think a lot of growers struggle with uh, for early establishment in this part of the world i mean uh you get too far north of I-70, as I understand, and you're going to have a little bit of trouble with establishment. So uh, from that standpoint, how, how does uh, having a tool in the toolkit like the interseeder help uh, overcome this? You know, right now that in this shorter season corn, the canopy is starting to break down. and But what this machine allows us to do is allows us to get in early while that soil is warm. We're not getting a whole lot of sunlight down there, but we're getting in when the soil is really warm. We're also getting in there around here in our irrigated acres ahead of that last irrigation so we can kind of settle that crop in. And then what we have, what will happen is as this, as this crop canopy starts to senesce and starts to open up and we get more sunlight, we'll get that earlier germination. And it's, and it's really the advantage is we can get that seed below the, the thicker portion of the canopy. You know, when that machine runs through the field, the, the, deflector, the deflector pans are are running about ear height they're a little lower in a lot of cases so we get that a lot of seed to get that good contact of the soil uh, a full across the row width so from row to row so we get it in the row we get it in the middle of the row um, and then like i said as that as that canopy starts to senesce and break down and open up uh, our germination is we get a lot more seed contact to the ground we get a lot more light on that earlier and we get into warmer soil and in and, and, and a more ideal moisture condition to where we can really maximize the investment this grower makes in cover crops because in a lot of cases we're asking growers to you know make a pretty sizable investment in a cover crop and if and if we apply it at the wrong time because it's because you know with our other methods we have to be in you know later in the year uh you know and higher up in the canopy we get a lot of that seed caught up in the canopy or it's so late that crop doesn't have a lot of time to establish before that first frost so this brings a lot of advantage to us to deliver the maximum amount of value out of a cover cross investment to our grower, which you know is going to be long term, is going to help us with the soil health initiative and 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 help use these tools because if we don't get the right establishment, we don't have the right application method, and growers are still trying to invest that money and not getting any value out of it, it doesn't matter how much we talk about soil health, we can't implement that plan if we don't have the right piece and right tools in our toolbox to do that.